myself, Dr. Chaitra Gururaj, Associate Professor, Department of Agadatantra, SDM College of Ayurveda and Hospital, Hassan. Today I am going to discuss on cumulative toxicity, a burning issue of today's era. Parcellus, father of toxicology says that all substances are poisonous. There is nothing which is non-poisonous. Only the dose makes the difference. The basic essentials of life, food, water and air are contaminated with various chemicals. Residue of chemical fertilizers, preservatives, uh, pesticides, then uh, coloring agents, adulterants have made our food unsafe today. Even the groundwater also is contaminated. We are not as safe as our ancestors to drink the natural water from natural resources. Unfortunately, available water purifiers remove these chemicals, but they, along with the chemicals, they also remove the micro elements which are required for the growth and repair of our body. When compared to outdoor air, it is the indoor air which is more contaminated due to ultraviolet organic compounds, volatile and non-volatile organic compounds. In this COVID crisis, it is unscrupulous use of medicaments, over-the-counter uh, over medicines and so-called detoxifying drinks, detoxifying food themselves are causing toxicity. These chemicals, they have affinity towards the specific target organs. They may end up in genetic disorders, hormonal imbalances, anemia, cancer, sterility, infertility, menstrual disorders in females and uh, uh, if it uh, accumulates in the respiratory system, it may end up in chronic cough, asthma, etc. Sometimes the chemicals may not be that much potent enough to produce the symptoms in this generation. But these chemicals, they accumulate in the body and produce the symptoms in the third generation. Because of the carelessness and ignorance of the present generation, the third generation will become a victim of this type of toxicity. How to differentiate this then? So the simple way is, if a disease is not responding to general management of that particular disease or if the symptoms are aggravating when exposed to marshy region or in a cloudy weather or by intake of specific food items or by day sleep, then one can suspect accumulation of toxins in that particular person. So remedy for this is detoxification therapy that is panchakarma. Undergoing regularly yearly once panchakarma will help to remove the toxins which are accumulated in the body. We do have many detoxifying drugs, but all these has to be taken only under strict medical supervision. So to conclude, log out from all the toxicity yearly once by undergoing panchakarma, just like the way you cleanse your house regularly and stay healthy. Thank you.